Let me try. Hello, y'all. This is Brushfire Windragon, and welcome back to World of Warcraft Shadowlands. Uh, you notice I'm a little alone today. <laughs> um, Mom got a bit confused and went ahead on gnarly. Oh well. Uh, I'll catch up with her. And um, probably won't be this week, uh, but I I do have uh, a new intro coming up soon. So be on the lookout for that. How may I serve? Hey. Through the wormhole. So, um, we're flying from Oribos to Bastion. I have to go through another portal. <laughs> and it's pretty cool. The ether worm is following this line of light, but it's like, are we going upside down and stuff? I guess technically. <laughs> And here's Gnarly, um, played by Gnarly Garland, played by my mom. Hello. Hi. <laughs> so, uh. By the Archon, the way is open. There's Clea. <laughs> She's lovely. So, how how far did you get? Uh, just a little ways. Okay. Allow me to show you the way. The way is open again. Archon, be praised. Our purpose is to serve. Forgive my reaction. You see, the way from Oribos has been closed for quite some time. We did not know if it, it would ever open again. I welcome you, noble soul, to Bastion. Your deeds in life have earned you a most glorious fate. You are to become a Kyrian, a winged bearer of the dead. I've already got wings, <laughs> technically. My name is Clea. I w it would be an honor to introduce you to our beautiful realm. There is much you must learn before your journey can begin. Gather yourself. When you are ready, we will venture on. Deep breaths. You likely have many questions. Do not worry. All will be explained in good time. Are you ready to begin the next chapter of your existence? Lead on, Clea. Whatever the challenge, it is my pleasure to welcome you to Bastion. Though you are like no soul I have ever seen before. No matter. Well, that's because I'm not dead, honey. You are to become one of the Kyrian. It is our sacred charge to bring mortal souls before the Arbiter for judgment. It has been an age since we last welcomed a new arrival. The Greeter will tell kind of you more like as soon as we awaken. Represents <clears throat> the the class. A what? How a lot of the uh, companies work in the real world. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with my add-ons. Turn off. Okay, it's not working. I'm going to have to turn it off. Oh. It won't let me. Hold on. I was gonna say Bastion reminds me of the uh, uh, classic Christian-centric uh, heaven add-ons. Okay, I'm gonna have to turn off. Which one? Was Silver Dragon. Well, I hadn't really thought about it that way, but okay. the way the information is given. Uh you're trying to tell them something weird is going on, and they don't really want to listen to you until you. No, do this line of quests like everybody else. Then you can tell us the information. Yeah, I just Clay is so excited to have somebody new there. I don't uh, think you she... think that in itself would make them all perk up. Yeah. You know? Okay. Not just like, hey, we haven't had any souls come through here for a I long time. You? And this isn't exactly a soul. This is a mortal being. Yeah, she hasn't realized I'm not a soul yet. The greeter will soon answer all of your questions. 
That is its purpose, after all. Clea smiles at you. I hope you're excited. I certainly am. Oh, yes, the greeter. It seems this uh, Nimbus unit has been deactivated. An anima has been so scarce of late. And with no new souls entering our gates, I suppose it was a prudent measure. Anima is our most precious resource, after all. There are some centurions nearby. A portion of their anima could serve our needs. Ah, one of our most helpful stewards is here to lend her aid. She will guide you in the collection effort. Return when you have sufficient anima, and we will power the greeter once more. Okay. Sika, can we spare any anima for the greeter? Yes, take my barrel. Centurions will share. Did you pick up the anima thing? I got Hold it. Tight now. Yeah. Okay. No anima must fall. I was letting Sika finish talking. <laughs> My anima for Bastion. Big ones have so much anima. This one, almost empty though. This one's lost its head. Don't worry, he come back How when Anima returns. We wake greeter now. The Centurion emits a soft chime. Anima reserves now nominal. Initializing. What knowledge do you seek? Welcome, worthy one. I am Greeter Nemes. It is my duty and pleasure to assist you on this, your first day among the Kyrian. Allow me to congratulate you. Your fate is reserved for the most noble of souls. Only those who lived a life of service may call Bastion home. I am certain you have many questions. All new aspirants do. Please allow me the honor of introducing you to the next chapter of your existence. We will begin when you are ready. It was my pleasure. From which world, system, entity, realm, or form of existence do you originate? I'm actually from another dimension, <laughs> but... I guess you could call my home Azeroth. I think there might have been some mistake. We understand that the end of a mortal's existence can feel abrupt, and is sometimes difficult to accept. You are not the first, nor will you be the last, to question the nature of your new existence. Please take this opportunity to process these facts and find acceptance. When you have done so, we will continue our orientation. I am not dead. I do not understand. Okay. I have some questions. I possess a wealth of knowledge. What do you wish to know? What can you tell me about Bastion? I can tell you that you are fortunate indeed to have arrived in Bastion. To have earned this honor, your mortal life must have been truly must have truly been selfless and dutiful. Should you continue to prove worthy, you will spend eternity as a Tyrion. You will help ensure souls are conveyed from the realm of the living for judgment before the Arbiter. No fight and all the Shadowlands is more desirable. Okay. What is your purpose? My Archon given purpose is to ensure all new arrivals are acclimated to the next step in their existence. I exist to teach others about the Kyrian. It is my honor and privilege to address you. Who is the Archon? The Archon rules our realm. She is the most stalwart and dedicated of the Eternal Ones. It is by her will that Bastion carries out its purpose in the Shadowlands. There is much more to say about this ancient maying, but such glories do not befit the ears of an aspirant. Perhaps when you achieve your wings, you may find yourself in her presence. Okay. What are these little owl things? Creator Nemeth makes a series of chiming sounds. I think she's laughing. Ah, owls. In your realm, these are nocturnal avians, yes? Greeter Nemeth gestures to Sika. This is a steward. They manifest from Bastion's anima to aid the Kyrian in their day-to-day -to -day task. They left nothing more than to be of service. Okay. What can you tell me about Centurions? Centurions, these constructs brought to life by anima serve many purposes in Bastion. They aid our aspirants in training, defend our lands, and perform menial tasks if needed. Some, such as the Nimbus classification, like myself, curate a wealth of knowledge on behalf of the archives. Okay. Okay, Nim. I. Th okay. Uh, 
I am not dead. I come from Azeroth. I greetings, denizen of Azeroth. We have prepared a number of activities to help you acclimate to your new existence. Please visit each station to learn more. I think orcs and Draenei can say I they're from Baynor. I will meet you there. Oh. Oh, you haven't taken one through yet? Well, I took Leilani through. Okay, and you didn't... Uh, I don't think it gave me a chance to say I was from Draenor. Oh. Hmm. I am or out of range. Me, or I just didn't Welcome, do it, new aspirants, to the first it's step in your journey through happened. Bastion. While you venture among us, we will teach you the virtues of purity, courage, humility, wisdom, and loyalty. You will cleanse yourself of your mortal flaws and ascend to a higher state of being, capable of performing our most sacred and difficult task. We have much to teach you, but have no fear. Your journey is your own, and you may walk the path at your own pace. Okay, I think that's everything. So there's five. Um... Purity, courage, humility, wisdom, and loyalty, yeah. So five, like the five houses of Maldraxxus. But uh, Ardenwild and uh, Revendreth aren't like that. The bells of Bastion will calm your soul. Listen and be at peace. The Vespers of Bastion <laughs> are no ordinary Sorry. instruments. Their voices bolster the spirit and draw forth the lingering burdens of one's former life. Oh, tranquility. <laughs> Welcome. Please add your name to the list of noble souls who now call Bastion home. Okay, I guess... All deeds from your previous life will be collected oh, yeah. and stored. The up. archives compile the histories of countless mortal worlds, as seen through the eyes of oh, aspirants like yourself. Oh, Arlo is needing some attention. Oh no! Can we pause for just a minute? Yes. Oh, that's not good. Okay, I think there's more anima motes down in the cave. All right, I am coming. Because I think it's seven or ten. And I gave three. So, five and how many did you add? Oh, eight? I don't know. Okay, yeah, it needs ten. We need two more. I picked up two, but I don't know if I'm giving it the right way. Oh, you click on it? And say supply anima mode. Oh, okay. I think I did that. Okay. Sorry, I grabbed both of those. That's all right. You can give the last one, last two. I oh, am okay. Waking. Apparently, I was. Let the right. assessment commence. Okay. You shall be weighed. You shall be measured. Oh, shoot.
A satisfactory oh, result. It. I yield. Nice. Okay. And we got the this quest. The incomprehensible core words with a pleasant hump. Surely someone would have a use for this. And uh can't do anything with it yet. What happened? <laughs> oh, bless you. I'm trying to stifle it so I didn't blow your eardrums out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, oh, wait, come here. I got a table up. Ooh, thank you. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, it's, it's a different thing this time. Okay. Last time it was pudding and now it's buns. There we go. All topped up. Now I gotta go take the, uh... Gonna take a bath with Kalea. <laughs> Step into the pool, friend. Passing through the veil can be traumatic. Allow us to cleanse the pain of that ordeal. Burden of life and... Oh, yeah, that one's out. What is that? It looks like a Kyrian, but it is twisted. How strange. Carry on with your learning. I will meet you near the greeter. You didn't have to find anything? Oh, no. Um, I don't think you're supposed to. Okay. That one's, that's not what I thought it was. There are little statues around you can read. I'm just trying to find them all. Each temple is presided over by a paragon. These ancient beings demonstrate the ultimate expression of their respective virtue and are responsible for the care and training of all aspirants that enter their domain. Presiding over the temple of purity is a symphony known for her grace and com compassion. Presiding over the temple of Cur courage is Xandria, known for her indomitable will and unyielding strength. Presiding over the Temple of Humility is Chiras, known for his insight and approachable nature. Presiding over the Temple of Wisdom is Thinios, known for his longevity of purpose and clarity of thought. Presiding over the Temple of Loyalty is Devos, known for her unwavering commitment to her people and the Archon. Each is bolted by their chosen hand. Selected for their excellence and service to their temple, you should expect to meet them all on your journey, as they will be an invaluable resource to complete the five rites. The Archon, Kyrestria, uh, the firstborn Archon of Bastion, has presided over this realm since the Shadowlands came into being. She is the example, the beacon in the darkness for aspirants and ascended alike. Her light illuminates the path you now walk. Her will keeps Bastion aloft. Her infinite wisdom safeguards us for all time. She awaits you at the end of this long road, for it is she who will grant you the gift of flight. And it is she who will charge you with our most sacred task. The Archon's eyes are surely upon you in this moment. Bearers perform the vital task of bearing souls across the veil to Oribos, where they will be given the fate they earned in life. Bearers are known for their adventurous spirit and indomitable will. They will see countless worlds beyond the Shadowlands. They will encounter beings of all shapes and sizes that will be carried to Oribos to serve their purpose. By their arms and their will, the great cycle continues. Being a bearer is a grave responsibility, but no carrion will know more of the world 
uh, worlds beyond than those who bear mortal souls. The Watcher. Watchers perform a difficult and emotionally taxing role among the Kyrian. As they who linger at the edge of the veil and greet mortal souls who seek to cross into the Shadowlands. It is the Watchers who weigh that soul, peer into its existence, and judge whether it is their time. As a Watcher, you will be burdened with that soul's memories, and you will see and know things that will weigh heavy on your mind. This role is only for the strong of heart, for those who can endure with the purpose in mind at all, in mind at all times. Few ultimately choose this path, but those who do are held in the highest regard. I think these are the ones you meet when you die in Azeroth and Draenor. Spirit Healers. The Collector. Collectors maintain the realm and contribute to all of Bastion's great works. They are responsible for the collection and ordering of anima in our realm. A collector may take the form of a forge light or perhaps a scholar. They craft armor, furnishings, carve statues, build fantastic works of architecture, and write our many stories and songs. They weave masterful works from anima itself. They are great craftsmen and musicians. A collector will, over the course of their eternity, dedicate themselves to honing their skill and perfecting the arts of their choice. They find a worthwhile existence in great works and are the source of Bastion's considerable beauty. There are many collectors, but no two are the same. In this role, you will serve to bolster the realm that you now call home. I don't think I've read those before. I haven't. <laughs> okay. About taking your time. Taking your time? <laughs> yes. You are a sign of the winds of change. I hope that was informative and relaxing. I have given your presence here some thought, Brushfire. It is clear to me that you are no ordinary arrival from Oribos. I do not know why you are here, nor what you hope to achieve. That alone is simply unprecedented. You must understand, individuals do not merely come to Bastion on a whim. This fate is earned, and those that are chosen for it are uniquely suited to its, this existence. So I ask you, why are you here, truly? We will fix this drought. We must. Why is it you have come here, Brushfire? Well, that's a long Our story. <laughs> here in, in service of the Maw? That cannot be. What is the meaning of this? They must have sensed that I enabled the Greeter. I will handle this, mortal. Why is this Nemesis unit active? We can ill afford this anima expenditure. Goodbye. Ascended One, this newcomer brings troubling news of Kyrian in the Maw. We must inform the Archon. A grim fate. But if the Arbiter judge them deserving of it, then the matter is not our concern. These were not prisoners, but willing servants. Surely this merits an audience. There is but one way to earn an audience with the Archon. To walk the path and prove worthy of ascension. State your purpose. Calisthene pierced down at you. We have heard you, mortal. If you wish to stand before the Archon, there is a path you must walk. Thankfully, it was well warm and serviceable even in these dire times. Though you are not destined to become Kyrian, our ways may be of interest to you. Learn well, learn fast, and perhaps the Archon will take notice and grant you this audience you seek. As Brent Clea will show you the way, Archon's eyes upon you. You know the path this is better the part than I was most talking aspirant. About. Oh. Archon's I, eyes upon you. I haven't souls for however long. It and something comes through and it's not even a soul, it's a mortal. Follow the path. As if we have we should be on our way. I don't know, but your mic seems to be messing up and I'm not everything's coming through. That's probably a good thing. Okay, let's go. Uh, 
that's how you want it. Ah, <laughs> uh, I ran down the steps. Okay. Yeah. Is that better? Yeah, I can hear you fine now, so I don't know what was happening. Well, I was just talking about that person's that that character's response to a mortal showing up is a my final oh hey a mortal wow we None should look into this since. yeah i know right <laughs> right just like you used up anima without my permission and i don't want to have to deal with this yeah basically Our realm must appear pristine to you. Words cannot express what was lost. Wait, let me show you. Okay, Clea's gonna show me the, uh, the vision. We are in the midst of an unspeakable tragedy. Oh, I see, I think I see a Volpira down Come. there. We will seek out my soulbind, Pelagos, at Aspirin's rest. Are you want to get up? Okay. There we go. Oh wow, he's got flaming cluff hooves. That sounds like a bad STD. <laughs> Maybe, maybe I shouldn't talk to today. <laughs> I, he's just in a weird state of mind today. <laughs> okay, have you gone down and helped Pelagos yet? No, I haven't. Okay, so, so that means I've caught up with you? Yeah, we should be. I already got the flight Claire, point, and that's all I did. Thank the Archon. I think. Pelagos began the ritual without you. What? That fool. We have little time. I love Pelagos. I the drought too. holds strong. One of my favorite we characters. We must find a solution. Your journey is just beginning, Brushfire. I hope you can help us. And I hope we can help you. Keep a calm mind. It's so nice to meet you. I am a, <laughs> a soulbind in need. Pelagos is my soulbind. He is my brother, my closest friend, my mentor, and my student. He knows me completely, and I him. It is a bond stronger than any other. That he now struggles is a torment to me, but I am forbidden from intervening. An aspirant must succeed or fail on their own men merits, or the trial is forfeit. I am bound by this law, but you are not. Please bring Pelagos back to me. This will not be his last trial, not while he may finally have a chance. Oh, I'll get some new leggings. I will ascend. As you will soon learn, a ritual cleansing can be a painful process. In most cases, the upwelling emo emotion is harmless. It can even generate anima under the right circumstances. However, sometimes the result is far less pleasant. Negative memories can take a form of their own and manifest in a violent fashion. I fear Pelagos' attempt at cleansing has brought forth such monsters. You must destroy them, and quickly. Pelagos may soon succumb to doubt and fear. Make haste. Okay, you ready to go help Pelagos? Ready. Mostly leave the little ones alone. Uh, this is impossible. Uh -oh. me. I'm so sorry. I do not have a 
target. That I need to eat. <laughs> Are you going to the left um, or right? I, was, I usually go to the right. Um, I haven't gone yet, though. I'm eating. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, look out! Yeah. Alone. Oh, alone. You need to eat again. Are you good? I'm. I'm okay. I swear I've encountered a. An elite in here once, but I haven't seen it again. That may be something they changed. Oh. Yeah. My apologies, I'm lagging behind. Oh, uh, that's okay. I, I ran downstairs. Ah, I, there was some memories behind me, but they've disappeared. Now we gotta go rescue Pelagos from the big one. Huh. Uh, help me! You I'm, are weak. I'm here. Ascension. Now Pelagos. Give in. It is good to see you. Huh. That was too close for comfort. Thank you. I feel much better now. Maybe we need to clean your mic or something. What? Because it's... The mic is saying you're saying stuff and you're not doing anything. Yeah, yours is doing that too. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's okay. It just makes kind of a little like sound, like, like an air sound. Yeah. I think that's just because we're breathing and stuff. Because it wasn't doing that before. It did the last time we played because we talked about it. Yeah, but not while recording. Yeah, I moved my mic a little bit. Is that better? That was reckless, Pelagos. You would have fallen if not for that mortal. I thought I could succeed on my own, but I was wrong. Well, so weird as it happens when you're not even at your desk. I think... Ah. I think this is a good point to stop. Because I'm gone over the 30 minute mark. Okay, so okay. you want to We don't have to stop recording. I'm just going to finish this recording. Okay, oh. uh, thank you all for watching. And um, I know we didn't do much, but uh, we'll definitely keep going next time. Thank you all for watching. And this is Brushfire Wind Dragon signing off.